Six Pack Surfer here, and I want to introduce everyone to a brand new series, Surfing Exercises to Help You Surf Better. This is going to be about a three to five part series. I'm going to share all my exercises that have helped improve my surfing. We're going to go ahead and throw science out the window on this one and go with our gut feeling, our gut instincts. And my gut tells me that all of these exercises have helped to improve my surfing. And if you're looking to pick up some new easy exercises to help improve your surf game, Go ahead and follow this series, like, smash, and subscribe. Sit back, kick back, relax, and enjoy the video. Welcome to part one of Six Pack Surfer's exercise routines. And the first exercise we're gonna learn is BOSU balance, okay? This is gonna help your basic balance on the board. Once you're already standing, just having more confidence being on top of the board on your feet Staying up, staying on your feet, and learning how to maneuver, getting a strong lower body here. So the first thing we want to learn is just to balance on the BOSU ball on the top side, just like this. That's the first step, first progression. After you're comfortable just balancing on here, we're going to go ahead and hit some squats on it, okay? Once you're good here, you're going to go ahead and just hit a basic down and up squat. Try to work your ankles. Work your feet, work the lower body strength, get about eight to 12 reps. When you're done, come back to the top and just poise yourself again. This is gonna help all of those little fibers in your ankles and your knees, all that good stuff to help get your balance down pat. Don't worry about him, all right? Just concentrate on what you're doing. Just like that, down and up, perfect. Once you're good there, confident there, you're gonna go ahead and flip it over. And learn to do the same thing now on the opposite side of the ball. This one's a little trickier to hit the balance, so that's the first step you're gonna get used to, getting up on it. Whoa, a little tricky even for me, but once you got it down pat, it's gonna help your balance on the surfboard. Once you're good here, same thing. Get used to that, and when you're ready, you're going to hit your squats. Same thing, 8 to 12 reps, down and up. Try to stay everything in a straight line. You can put your hands out to keep your balance. Try to keep your knees straight over your toes. Work those ankles, concentrate, 8 to 12 reps. Same thing, once you're good there, down, all the way up. Poise yourself, congratulate yourself. You made it through step two. This is gonna help your confidence staying up on that surfboard immensely. I know it's helped me out to stay on the board longer, hitting my turns, hitting my cuts, picking up speed better. Now on to number three. Single leg. Gonna try to hit your balance with one leg at a time. And this one's a little tricky, so I might mess up. Same thing here, just wanna get used to having your balance. Try to get those ankles, those knees, those calves, and that leg just a little bit stronger. All those little fibers in your nervous system, get, get them used to being nice and balanced and stable. That's gonna increase your confidence when, you got, when you're on your two feet. All right, so one leg at a time, boom. Same thing, make sure you hit your opposite leg. It's tricky, so if you don't hit it at first, just keep trying. Keep practicing, follow the progression steps. Eventually you'll get there. Try to keep that balance as long as you can. It might not be pretty, but it's effective. Good. All right, now here's the culmination. Once you have all of that down, you can try to go ahead and hit a single leg squat. Just gonna try to get up on your one foot, lower your body as far as you can go. It doesn't have to be pretty, you just gotta find a way to make it happen. Go ahead and lower yourself and come back up. Lower yourself and back up, just like that. Here you can start on lower reps. Try to get that one rep first, one to three, three to five, five to eight eventually, and then finish up with just a single, single rep. That's what I like to do. So again, other side. Now I'm a righty, so it's a little bit harder on my left side. I'm gonna go down as far as you can go all the way up. Try to really hit that balance at the top to gain that confidence. 
All the way down, we're shaking, we're wobbling. All the way back up. Just like that. Start with a couple reps, work your way up to eight to 10. Follow the progression steps, one through three. I promise you'll be more confident on your feet on the surfboard, more confident getting up, more confident once you're up, and then you're gonna be ready to really work that surfing. All right, so that's part one of my series, surfing exercises to help improve your surf game. Hope you enjoyed. Stay blessed, and ciao, everyone. Six Pack Surfer out. Oh, and by the way, if you're wondering, why do they call me the Six Pack Surfer? Well, <laughs> shouldn't be too hard to figure that out. So if you enjoy my videos, go ahead and like, comment, and subscribe to that smash button. I'll see you in the water. Six Pack Surfer out. <laughs>